Ryan, first of all, congratulations on being the Calhoun's High School Athlete of the Week. Thank you. You guys uh, played the, your final uh, official home game tonight, and uh, you come up with three big goals. Is it uh, kind of nice to uh, to go out on a uh, on a good note like that? It's nice to go out with a bang. First hat trick I've scored at Farragut. It's pretty exciting. Fun when the fans get into it and get with you. Now the uh, the second goal I believe it was was uh, off of a, a free kick, and uh, is that something you guys work on a lot? It was an amazing shot into the upper corner. <laughs> we don't work on that too much in practice. It's just if you want to hit it, you get apple. And apple just means I'm going to hit this at the goal. Be ready. Is that right? All right. Now, as, as you look at this team, obviously uh, you guys uh, rank nationally. Is, uh, is that kind of a neat thing? Do you guys talk a lot about maybe trying to win a mythical national championship? It's nice to know that you're right there. It's one of the top programs in the nation and being number two. We're definitely striving to be number one, and we want to stand defeated and make sure that's still an opportunity by the end of the season. Now, as, uh, as you look at this team, obviously, uh, you guys got a bunch of seniors. It was senior night tonight. They almost had to extend the halftime to get everybody introduced. Have you guys been playing together all that time? A lot of us have been playing on club teams for five years or so. I mean, there's about ten of us, and then others have been playing with each other in high school, and it's just it's fun playing with everybody, everybody together. We know each other. It's and, a lot now, of fun. and now, as as you look at the tournament coming up, obviously uh, a lot of pressure on you guys. You're the favorites going in, but the fact you've been there before is how much does that mean to you? Experience is a big factor. We know that everyone's gunning for us. I mean, we're undefeated. We're not ranked number one in the state. We know that everyone's going to be coming after us, and we have to play our best game every game because teams are going to be coming. As you look at uh, at this season, has there been uh, ups and downs for you? You guys been pretty much consistent all the way through. There's a little down point at when we came back from Palmetto Cup where we faced some of the best teams in the nation. Kind of a hangover from that, but <laughs> we came back from that strong, I think. Talk about that experience. You guys, I think, went to Charlotte, if I'm not mistaken, and, and played, I think, three of the top 15 teams in the country and, and won all three of those games. That has to help uh, give you confidence. Yeah, we went to Columbia, South Carolina. Okay, and there we you go. knew going in we were going to play some of the best teams, and we knew that national title hopes were on that. And we came in there and played as hard as we could and came out with victories. It was good feeling to come up on top against those teams. Now, obviously, you're a senior and uh, heading to college next year. I understand that uh, this may be it for soccer. You're going to kind of concentrate on your studies. Is that pretty much the way it is? That's right. I'm going to work at engineering at UT. I got one tournament with the club team after high school season, but that's about it for competitive soccer. Now, how many offers uh, do you think you would have gotten if you decided to go the other way? Has it been a hard decision or was it pretty easy? Uh, it was kind of tough. A lot of schools contacted me, but I decided engineering and soccer would be a lot of work and more concentrated on school. All right. Hey, congratulations on a great finish and best of luck at the state tournament. Thank you.